Hi, my name is Greg Dahl with Oregon Burls, and you may remember my blog on uh, how to gather burls legally. Um, you can. This is a madrone burl right here, and you can see it has the tag right there that makes this burl legal. Not a, every burl has to have this tag though to be legal. You just need documentation. Well, today I'm going to show how to cut a bowl blank or a vase blank to where the bird's eye is straight up and you'll have the nicest figure that way. Now, a, a week ago, I split this down the middle, uh, and right now I'm gonna just trim it up. You can't really see the good figure because it's been sitting for a while. But, uh, we'll get some fresh cuts in here and you'll see the figure pop out. Well, this is that. I I spilled some oil on my saw, uh, so it's smoking. Uh, but anyways, this is all burl. This is what we want to uh, make blanks out of. All right, you see this discoloration right here? This is uh, that uh, bacteria that you've heard about in Madrone and others, where it starts to spalt, but I wouldn't call this spalting. Uh, this is the fresh, fresh wood that the, the gray has not reached. Um, but what we're going to do is we're going to measure. This is six inches right here. And we're going to make uh, six inch cubes, but again, bird's eye straight up. So what I need to do is just mark a six inch line. And that's where my cut's going to be. We'll go down that way. You can see that uh, before I was getting clean chips. Now I'm getting dirty chips. That means there's a pocket of dirt in here and I'm going to have to resharpen my saw real soon. All right, we're done with the cut. So we're gonna crack this thing open and see what we have. All right, you can see that uh, I don't know if you can see the grain or not. I'm going to move you a little bit closer. There's grain. There's two pockets of dirt. I had to go through a rock. One thing with burls is you're going to hit rocks. So it's a pretty figure right there. All right, now this is the piece that we're going to make uh, six inch cubes out of. We already have thick, six inches that thick right there. Now what we need to do is cut six inches, but I'm going to fudge a little bit because uh, sometimes there's cracks here. This is an old burl. This is not a fresh burl. This is not what fresh burls look like. This has actually been cooked for about three months and it's been sitting in the water and that's how the gray got all through it. Uh, yeah, in big six, uh, 7,000 gallon vats. So I'm going to mark it about right there. And that's going to be our cut. I'm just going to make one cut right down, right down here. And then we can go to the bandsaw. This is the block that we cut from outside, and my first cut has to uh, make this bottom edge flat as can be so that I could be square using the bandsaw.
start cutting it into six inch blocks now that we have two edges that are flat. Two quarter socks and ready to be made into a hollow part.